Hello, welcome back to another story with Rob. This time, as we're carrying on with our Christmas theme, coming up to Christmas, Christmas jumpers, we have our first Winnie the Pooh book, I think we've done, which is Winnie the Pooh, Pooh's Christmas Adventure. And this says on the back, here we are. On a cold and snowy day in the Hundred Acre Wood, working together warms the heart of Winnie the Pooh and friends. So, you may have heard of Winnie the Pooh. You may not, but it's one of my favourite ones growing up, Winnie the Pooh. Surprised we haven't done one before. But here we are, Pooh's Christmas Adventure. So, let's dive right in. It was a cold, snowy day in the Hundred Acre Wood. Winnie the Pooh watched the snowflakes fall outside his window. I love it when it snows, Pooh said, but it makes me so very hungry. Pooh decided to have his favourite snack, honey. When Pooh finished eating, he looked out of the window again. Now all he could see was white. Oh dear, he thought, something is wrong with the windows. But soon he realised he was snowed in. What shall I do, he wondered. Hmm. After much thinking, Pooh had an idea. He could use his honey pot to dig himself out. All this work is making me rather hungry, Pooh said as he tunnelled through the snow. But I've run out of honey. Perhaps Piglet has some. Pooh arrived at Piglet's house and found him snowed in too. So Pooh used the honey pot to dig out his friend. It took him quite a bit of time. Thank you, said Piglet when Pooh finally reached Piglet's door. You rescued me. It's no bother, puffed Pooh, trying to catch his breath. Do you have any honey? I'm afraid not, Piglet said. But Owl might. Pooh and Piglet walked to Owl's house and found that he was snowed in too. They all, all seem to be snowed in. Suppose I'll have to dig again, Pooh sighed. It will be easier if we dig together, Piglet suggested. What a grand idea, said Pooh. Pooh and Piglet worked together to dig out Owl. This time the digging went much more quickly. Thank you, Owl said as he opened his door. Would you like some hot tea? With honey? Pooh asked hopefully. Still after the honey. After warming up inside Owl's house, the three friends went to dig out Rabbit. Things were going quite well until they heard a scratching sound. Whatever could that be? Pooh asked. P Perhaps it's a heifer lump, Piglet cried. Oh dear, not the heifer lump. Suddenly, Rabbit burst through the snow. What are you doing here? Rabbit cried. We're here to dig you out, Piglet said. But I was coming to dig you out, Rabbit said. Rabbits are natural diggers, you know. Well, perhaps we ought to go and dig Eeyore out, Owl suggested. With the four of us, it should take no time at all. So Pooh, Piglet, Owl and Rabbit went to Eeyore's house. Everyone helped with the digging and they uncovered Eeyore's house in no time. Pooh tugged on the bell rope to let Eeyore know they were there, but it made a very peculiar sound. Ow! If I'm not mistaken, Rabbit began, I'd say that's not a bell rope, that's Eeyore's tail. I'm terribly sorry, said Pooh. Don't worry, Eeyore sighed. No one bothers about me anyway. But Eeyore, Piglet explained, we've just rescued you. And now that you're, you've been rescued, let's see if Christopher Robin needs our help. Pooh, Piglet, Owl, Rabbit and Eeyore came upon Christopher Robin in the forest. Are you stuck? Shall we help you out? We're really quite good at it now, said Pooh. I'm not stuck, you silly old bear, laughed Christopher Robin. I'm making a snowman. 
A snowman? Pooh asked curiously. How'd you make one of those? I'll show you, Christopher Robin said. If we all work together, it'll be an even better one. So Christopher Robin, Pooh and Rabbit helped to roll a giant snowball for the snowman's body. Eeyore found stones to use for the snowman's face. Piglet searched for twigs to use as arms. And Owl flew them into place. This is the grandest snowman I've ever seen, Christopher Robin said. And I couldn't have done it without all of you. And there's their snowman. The end. So there we are. So Pooh's Christmas adventure. Digging everybody out. And building a nice snowman. Sounds like a great adventure to have in the snow. So there we are. Winnie the Pooh, Pooh's Christmas Adventure. Thank you very much for watching. Hope to see you next time for more Stories with Rob. Bye-bye.